So, the Paul Moores. Handicap final, the shorter version, the three mile five is uh, race 32 on your cards. We've got a field of 16 here to go where you can have one or two entries, three maybe, if you had three that qualified. Well, let's have a look. So, Kiss of Fire, Darren Thompson's going to be the top of the pile. Second is Pray for the Queen for Josh Sutherland. Jockey Assassin for Paul Rose is three. Lord Babushka for Martin Lee is four. Bishop Brennan for Kevin Minahan is five. The French Foreign Legion for Darren Thompson is six. Eve's Delight for Graham is seven. Hollander for Stu Gray is eight. Proud Tarquin and Last Suspect for Kevin Minahan. The well, uh, Tills with Glenboy for Obi One, Malta Benny for Molly at Surfer, Hillbilly Boy for David Robertson, In Traction for Kevin Meanhand, Sphinx walks in for Darren Howes and Montoya for James Follis. As I said, make up 16. I think uh, good old Kevin Meanhand's come here pretty mob handed. He'll be looking to win this. I think he's got four entries. As we zoom around the course here, just aim tree as we know. You can see all these lovely fences. Some helicopter ride. Do, 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 do. And there's the horses. They're about to start, and you can see they get to that first fence quite quickly. Star has got them away for the three mile five. Paul Moore's handicap final for the Grand National Course. Good luck. Everybody streams over the first, so a good start. Everybody's still on their feet. And as I said, yeah, we've got Kevin Meanham with uh, four in this one. His last suspect's the one that's going to lead it. He's going to lead them down to the second, which is the canal turn. Straight off. The leaders are over it, as is the remainder. A little bit of a poor jump towards the rear by Tillsworth Glenboy there. A little bit of error as he went over it, but he's still on his feet. And we've still got well over three miles to travel. Come to the third, a small open ditch, everyone's over it. So it's last suspect but leads from Proud Tarquin, his teammate. And we've got Sphinx Ward Watson and Lord Babushka out wide. Coming back towards the fences, Montoya in the blue silks. And get over the fourth, and we've got uh, the two DT horses, Darren Thompson's French Foreign Legion and Kisses of Fire. Also quite wide, and then mid pack is Malto Benny Montoya. He's delight and Tillsworth Glenboy's moved up into the pack now. And towards the rear, we've got. I think Bishop's Brennan's there, Lord Babushka's the widest of all. Jockey Assassin, Hillbilly Boy, Hollander in Intractions, they go over the six and they're all still standing. And last suspect leads by about five to Proud Tarkin, Pray for the Queen and Sphinx Waltz in the length back to the rest of the pack. And one just bringing up the rear at the moment is Intraction and Hollander. Black Silk's out wide. And three miles still to go. It's last suspect. Got 24 fences here. Crowd. Rah, rah. As you can see, they're going to swing left handed to line up. That's why they go for the elbow. And it's still last suspect. That's going to lead them past the winning post for the first time. And after they get over the seventh, I assume he does. He does. As does the rest. A couple of sticky jumps in the rear. Honda didn't get over it particularly well. Still being led by last suspect. Oh, a little bit of a pause there. Let's get to the eighth. The leaders are over it. As is the remainder. There's again a bit of a poor transmission here. I'm not sure if you're seeing this back at home. But I'm getting uh, a jerky transmission. But it's still last of us over the leaders and everybody's still on their feet as they go past the grandstand. Big nice jump there by the leader. And it's still last suspect. Tools with Glen Boys moving into second now comfortably. They go over the water. Everybody's still on their feet, so it's last suspect from Tools with Glen Boy. Pray for the Queen, French Foreign Legion, and Proud Tarkin together. And a length and a half back to Lord Wabushka, Bishop Brennan, Malto, Benny. Montoya kisses a fire, the jockey assassins towards the rear. And, uh, being brought up by Sphinx Waltz in Hollander, Eve's Delight and in Traction. But up front, last suspect still leads us. Happy to bowl along in front with just over two miles to travel. Only a few races left to go. Four mile three. Paul's Moore's final coming up next. Martin's going to commentate for you as they get to the 11th here. They're all over it. Just at the 
rear now is EU's delight for Graham Clutterbuck. But it's last suspect that still leads by about four to French Foreign Legion. Tills with Glen Boy, Proud Tarquin and Pray for the Queen as they will go to the twelfth half of the fence is done now. And we're losing one there. He's delights being pulled up. Unlucky Graham. A bit early normally for a pull up. And we're under the 13th. And everybody, all bar he's delight, is still in this race. And the ones at the rear will be knowing that that pull up. Oh, and we're losing another. The jockey assassin's going. Poor will be unhappy with that one. That's two out now. Both been uh, subject to the pull ups. Could well be injured. We've still got a couple to go, but we're still being led by Lars Aspect over the 15th. Everybody's over that, so everybody uh, jumping relatively well. Nobody uh, getting off their horse. Anybody falling. Getting very good at jumping over these entry fences. Oh, we're losing another Montoya's going now. Lucky James. Sl sliding out of the race of the pull up. Just ten furlongs to go. It's the last aspect that leads him over that one. Oh, and we'd lost one. Lord Babushka's gone. Finally get a fall out. Sorry, Martin. Hollander uh, didn't jump it well either. But they come to the canal turn for the second time. It's the last aspect that's going to lead them over it. He jumps it well. As does the rest. Hollander took it poorly at the back again. I'd be surprised if he uh, gets to the end. But it's the last suspect. Tools with Glen Boy, Proud Tarquin, French Foreign Legion, pray for the Queen. So, oh, and we've done. Hillbilly Boy's gone, Jockey got off him there. Had enough, so there's another one down. So, in this second circuit, we're down five now. As we get to the 20th, going in hand, still got four horses in this. And it's Loud Suspect and Proud Tarquin, but on the outside is Molto Benny pushing through, pray for the Queen. Still seven furlongs to go as they go over the 21st. Molto Benny didn't take it particularly well, and pray for the Queen's taking it up now. So, pray for the Queen. Goes into the lead by a couple of lengths from Last Suspect, Proud Tarquin in third, Molto Benny trying again. They get it on, we've lost another there. Tillsworth Glenboy's gone. Unlucky Obi. But it's Pray for the Queen, last suspect, Proud Tarquin and Molto Benny moving well on the outside now. Bishop Brennan's there, French Foreign Legion. I imagine it will be between these Hollanders trying to run on in traction. Kiss the Vine sinks Wharton's at the last. So we're inside the final half a mile now, and it's Molto Benny that's taking it up. Well known for his grand national winning horse, but it's Molto Benny that leads by a couple now to Pray for the Queen. Last suspect, Bishop Brennan, Proud Tarquin. Hollander running on well now. French Foreign Legion doesn't look like he's got any Think left in traction, kiss the fine sphinx walks in, are not going to win from there as we come down to the three furlongs from home. A Molto Benny for Molly at Surfer leads him over the penultimate, but he was slow. And here comes Bishop Brennan, so it's Molto Benny, Bishop's Brennan, pray for the Queen and Hollander. But Molto Benny still leads inside the two and a half. It's Molto Benny by a length and a half from Bishop Brennan, pray for the Queen and Hollander. Molto Benny still over the last, he jumps it well, as does Bishop Brennan, but it's between them now inside the furlong and a half of flat running now, and it's Molto. Benny from Bishop Brennan, pray for the Queen. Hollander running on well on the outside, but Molto Benny's holding off Raiders at the moment as they come down to the furlong. It's Molto Benny. Molto Benny from Bishop Brennan, pray for the Queen, really trying hard for inside the final half. Molto Benny, Bishop Brennan getting one last lunge at it, but Molto Benny's holding them all off here. Molto Benny, Bishop Brennan, here comes Pray for the Queen. Has he timed it? He has a Molto Benny's going to hang on to it from Bishop Brennan. Pray for the Queen. Another. Entry course win for Molly at Surfer. Well done. Takes a three mile five. Paul Moore's handicap final with Molto Benny. Almost pray for the Queen there. And Bishop Brennan in third. And I think Hollander and. Oh, that's, I can't proud Tarquin, I think. Fall out for fourth and fifth. Well done, Molly at You've cracked the entry Grand National course and taken it with Molto Benny. Second was Pray for the Queen for Joshua Sutherland. Third was Bishop Brennan for Kevin Meanham. Fourth was Proud Tarquin also for Kevin Meanham. And fifth was Hollander for Stu Gray.